Eucalyptus oil is the generic name for distilled oil from the leaf of eucalyptus, a genus of the plant family Metaceae native to Australia and cultivated worldwide. Eucalyptus oil has a history of wide application, as a pharmaceutical, antiseptic, repellent, flavoring, fragrance and industrial uses. The leaves of selected eucalyptus species are steam distilled to extract eucalyptus oil. Eucalyptus is a tree, eucalyptus oil is distilled oil derived from the leaf of the tree and is used as medicine. Native to Australia eucalyptus oil is popularly used as an antiseptic, pharmaceutical and as flavoring in perfumes and cosmetics, a tree that is now cultivated worldwide. Its oil is also used for industrial purposes. Eucalyptus oil have been used for centuries for its medicinal benefits especially for treating colds and congestion for which it is still popularly used, even surgeons also used it for its antiseptic properties during the 18th century. The main ingredient in the eucalyptus leaves is eucalyptol, an oil known to fight infections and have expectorant properties and as such eucalyptus oil is used for a number of ailments from bronchitis to snoring. Eucalyptus oil is found as an ingredient in cough syrups, vapor rubs, inhalers and throat lozenges all over the world. Eucalyptus oil is popularly known to treat any problem of the respiratory system because it opens the lungs, clear nasal passages and is one of the main reasons why its main ingredient eucalyptol is found in a variety of cough drops. Studies have proven that eucalyptus oil is beneficial for all the above ailments and many more because of its antibacterial, analgesic, anti-inflammatory, antiviral properties and oil with a sweet fruity camphorous aroma. Eucalyptus oil must not be used on infants and children under two years old and should be diluted if used close to them. If your infant is experiencing trouble breathing, it is of great importance to contact a healthcare practitioner immediately before administering any form of medication. Eucalyptus oil should not be taken by mouth or applied to the skin directly, it should be diluted for safety measures.